Hello guys, it's uh, me again, Sharky. Today uh, I'm gonna try for carp. I'm in uh, Beverwijk uh, today. This is uh, the stuff I'm fishing with today for the carp. Uh, I made it myself. Um, I will add a list in the screen. Um, comes out of the fridge, so I'm gonna put it in the water uh, to melt it a bit and um, prepare my rods. And uh, what I use is these indicators. I'll click it um, on the line. Those uh, thingies, let me see, there they are. Just click it on the line, I added some lead weights. So that will pull uh, yeah, the empty hook towards me, so I don't uh, waste my time uh, with an empty hook up there. Um, I don't see any uh, fish movement at the moment, but I certainly saw uh, while preparing the rods. Um, the geese are also still there. Yep, they are. How are you? And um, let's give it a try. There we go. So this is the hook I'm going to use uh, today. Uh, I press down the, the, the barbs, don't need them. Four minutes at most and um, I had a carp already, but it's uh, in the bush over there. I'm gonna try to keep on filming and um, see if I can get it out of the, the woods. Nope. Gonna break the line. Uh, fishing. Okay, uh, attach a new hook to the to the rod. Uh, I will now add uh, the bait. Uh, I will show you how I do it. It's a bit wet, so um, I needed uh, some flour, and I just drop it in there to make it a bit more stiff. So that it won't uh, fall off that easily, but um, yeah, it's good when it's um, soft. You know, the, the hook uh, will, will set easily instead of uh, when it's um... okay. Hmm. Okay. That was the job. Fell off. Well, seems uh, like a lot uh, is happening here. I'm here uh, for 15 minutes now at most, and um, I uh, just missed my second carp in that short time. And um, there's one sniffling around uh, right now. Hope my uh, hook is not empty yet. I will uh, aim the cam at my um, indicators and see if they will uh, fly up. Shit, I have a carp on now. Um, it's in the bush over there. I hope uh, it's still on, on the line. Sometimes, uh, yeah, you see the fins come up. But, uh, no. We'll, we'll lose this one as well. <laughs> uh oh, he's off the line. No, he's not. He's still on. Yeah, here's my first fishy. There you are. Yay! My first carp. Let's land it. There we go. This is a carp. It's a small one. It's uh, let's say 45, 50 centimeters. Let's put it back quickly. Okay, there we go. There you go, Tessie! Play! You! Card number one this season. <laughs> this is epic! Look at this! You won't believe it! <laughs> I got a fish on both rods! <laughs> Let me see, where's the second one? One is gone, but the other one is still on. Let's uh, get it in. Oh, there goes my rod! 
two fish at the same time. <laughs> oh, what a mess. Oh, oh. It's a fighter, this fish. Going over there. <laughs> that was stupid. Two rods, two fish. There he goes. Whoa. Yeah, yeah. We got ourselves a fighter. It's even uh, going through the drag. I adjust the drag to uh, prevent uh, the line from breaking. Just uh, use uh, 2500 or 3000 of uh, a mil of monofilament. And this fish is going like there's no tomorrow. It's a small thingy, but hey, stop firing, mate. There you are. No, still not. There you go. Hello. <laughs> I think that was uh, spectacular actually, uh, I'm fishing with two rods uh, and I had um, a fish on each uh, <laughs> one of it. That was special, um, so to say. Um, I broke my line. Oh, there's another fish. Biting. Uh, let me put it like this and see if this works. It's busy on the spot. One fish after the other. I see bubbles everywhere, they're all around. Only landed uh, two fish this far, but um, yeah, I had a couple uh, more on uh, and, and I lost them. Uh, that's part of the game, losing fish makes it uh, attractive too. It's called uh, fishing, not catching, so um, where's the fish? Come on, we started to bite. Hmm. Fell asleep or something. Not sure what happened. Um, what I'll show next is um, how I attach um, my hook to the line. Holy. So, one time uh, through the eye, then I make a loop, go up to the top, and turn it some. Seven times around the shaft, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, through the loop again, lubricate, and then hold it, pull it, make it a bit nice, like this. And we got ourselves a great knot. Okay. The rest of the line. Uh, here's my bait ball. Let's attach. Oh, it's a bit too soft. Was there um, a bit more line? I can uh, dump it in the in the flour. Add some flour to it to make it drier and uh, a bit harder by that. And uh, this is a great bait. Made it myself. We'll give the recipe uh, on screen right now. Um, don't know <laughs> how to say that in English. Okay, there we go. Uh, fish number uh, three on the line. It's pulling a bit. Uh, there he tries to go again. Good fishing here. A lot of uh, activity. Let's try to uh, drag it in and uh, show the fish to you. Okay. There he goes again. It's a puller. Nice fighting fish up here. They must be healthy. They're not so big. I haven't seen a big fish this far. It's all uh, yeah, 50 centimeters max. But uh, yeah, they can easily grow to a meter. So uh, <laughs> it's not too big, but it's good fishing. Now come on, fishy. Cooperative a bit. Doesn't run uh, through my drag anymore, so it's getting a bit weaker. That's how it is. 
Hoppla! There we are. Number three. Okie dokie. Oh, nice looking fish. I pressed down the barb so uh, hooks come out uh, easily. Um, here's another carp. Okay, there we go. Wash my hands. That's always funny when I do that here in front of me. Always uh, the carps appear on that spot where I wash my hands. It's funny. Oops, that was a fart. Okay. Let's put some uh, new bait on the hooks and uh, let's try again. Going pretty good today. Cannot complain. There are my friends, uh, the geese. They uh, are guardians for me. They make a lot of noise if uh, someone appears, so uh, that's great. Um, it's getting a bit quiet on the fishing spot. I added some more uh, bait to attract the fish. Um, let's have a look at the spot itself. I think it's nice up here. Especially that, uh, that overhang, that, uh, that tree in the water is, is a good for the spot for the, for the carp uh, to cruise around. I use my uh, 30 hundredths uh, of, a, of a mill um, near the tree and 25 uh, in, in the middle of the water. And um, yeah, what I look at, I don't think you can see that, but it's my fishing lines. They are in an, uh, yeah, an angle, so to speak, <laughs> uh, a, a bulge or whatever you call it. And uh, I have a look at the line and uh, as soon as... Uh, I see something happening there. I, I uh, start to watch the indicators up there. Um, they go up or they go down, uh, depending on what uh, direction the, the fish will uh, swim. And then uh, it's a striking mode for Sharky and uh, even possibly a fish. Uh oh, is it going to happen again? Um, bait on uh, two rods at the same time again. So let's see what happens. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I see them everywhere. The other rod, again. Let's see. Yeah, this one going. Yeah. And have it. Yes, got it. That's number four. It's on the other side of the... Oh, oh goes all directions. Oh, it's in the drag already. Nice fishy. It's on the water's edge there. Yep, yep. Let's drag in some more line. Yes, fishy. Oh, oh. It's pulling. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yep. Good action in the rod, and there the fish, finally appears, still fighting, nice strong fish again. Not that big, same uh, 50 centimeter uh, at most, but uh, good fighting fish. Let's have a look. It's uh, the biggest uh, this far, a bit more than uh, 50 centimeters. Hook will uh, get out easily as usual, yes. And so that's carp number four. Let's have a closer look. Nice fishy, was very strong, the strongest this far. Okay, let's put it back quickly. Alright, uh, I'm here for some uh, two and a half hours now. Uh, I caught uh, five uh, nice carps and uh, yeah, lost a couple. Could have had uh, a lot more, but uh, yeah, I think I'm uh, gonna call it a day. Um, yeah, it was good being here, nice spot. Let's have a look at the sheep. Yep. Sheep. Meh. There they are. There's my geese. Okay guys, see you later. Going to check out here. Next time. Bye bye.